Okay, today I am working on a 98 Cadillac DeVille, and uh, I'm going to show you how to do a water pump on these North Star 32 valve V8 engines. Uh, right here is where the water pump sets into. Um, there's an O ring that sits in here. This is what all I had to take out right here. Air box, air inlet tube. Uh, here's all the new parts. Uh, I'm going to be replacing the hoses and stuff because uh, they all had to come off anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and replace them. Uh, new water pump cover gasket, uh, new water pump belt. The thermostat, there's the water pump cover with the thermostat, there's the gasket that goes in the water pump to seal it, new water pump, old water pump, you're going to need this uh, uh, water pump uh, removal tool, it's just a socket, you can run it from any parts store. Okay, I just wanted to give you an, an, a basic idea of how this uh, uh, water pump uh, removal socket remover, uh, how it works. Uh, you can see on this water pump, it's got locks on it that actually lock it in to the, uh, to the housing. So, and this goes on here like that and then you twist the socket and it uh, puts it on and off for you just to give you a basic idea of how that works okay with this o-ring that you see right here uh, what I did to make it stay in place, it didn't want to stay in place, you may have this problem I just took a little bit of grease and uh, stuck it on the o-ring to make it just stick into place to where I can get the water pump on it once the water pumps in it, and that's it. Okay, I've already installed the, the new water pump. Um, I'll show you here how this tool goes on. It just goes on there like that. And uh, you use the same tool to, to put it on as you do take it off. Uh, you might need a little cheater bar to help you uh, get it on and off. Uh, don't use an impact on these. Because uh, this is aluminum and you will crack it if you use an impact on it. Uh, I just used a little cheater bar and uh, it came right off and the new one went right on. Uh, this time I went ahead and uh, got the uh, tensioner off, the belt tensioner. For the uh, new belt, uh, you have to take the tensioner off in order to uh, place the belt. It's so uh, snug and tight. That's where it sits, right there, just like that, and it's held in by two bolts that run right alongside the uh, water pump cover, right there. Okay, here's our new water pump gasket cover in place. It's, uh, okay, I got our water pump cover back on, it's held in with four bolts two on top, one on the bottom, and one on the side, way back there. That was a little hard to get to. Uh, also, in a, I noticed this, uh, you might want to check your pulleys too. This pulley right here is, uh, the bearings are going on in it. This pulley is what, uh, it's a belt tensioner pulley. So uh, I'm going to have to replace that. Okay, I've got everything back on. Uh, got the wishbone uh, motor mounts back on from both sides. Had to take off both sides to uh, get the hoses off. Uh, just made it easier for this side to get everything off. I uh, got the air filter box back into place, the housing back into place. All that's really left to do now is uh, put the air filter and the, the top on and the inlet tube and uh, fill it up with water and make sure it doesn't leak. Okay, got it all back together. Uh, no leaks. See that there? No leaky 
Jesus. That's just from the overflow. Took the cap off and it flowed out a little bit. And that's how you do a water pump on a Cadillac uh, North Star 32 valve.